Keeping my language alive today is very important because without a cultural background, I feel as though I have no sense of belonging. Tuvalu is considered a minority within our Basifika community. Although I didn't really grow up attending many Tuvaluan community functions, I did grow up speaking the language at home, which I've always been grateful for, as I haven't lost my native tongue in the midst of constantly speaking English at school, work and social places. Now that I have my own children, I try to implement the importance of speaking and understanding the Tuvaluan language by speaking to them daily through basic words and saying grace. What led me to pursuing a nursing career is the maternal instinct I have to help others. The ongoing health issues we have in New Zealand has been a major impact to many lives, predominantly in our Basifika community. And my goal is not only to be an addition to the field, but to be a positive influence, to support and enhance the knowledge of those who don't understand certain medical terms, struggle with language barrier, or are just in general afraid to ask for help. When you choose to work in a pathway of helping others and slowly drift away from your duties, remind yourself why you started in the first place. I believe that knowledge is power when it comes to better health. Do we loa kudo malosi. Fafetai.